The UK's chief trade negotiator has criticised the EU's ideological approach to talks and warned that there could be a no-deal Brexit as talks make little progress. David Frost, who leads the government's Taskforce Europe group, has urged ministers to plan for the possibility that a new trading arrangement could break down as he gives the EU two weeks to change their stance. Mr Frost has told ministers to take the moral high ground when talking to their counterparts in the EU, in a desperate bid to get talks running smoothly or face a walkout. Last week Mr Frost tweeted a statement warning there had been very little progress towards an agreement between the UK and the EU. Mr Frost is due to publish draft legal texts for a proposed deal in an attempt to get negotiations moving. He said the EU was putting up a major obstacle which would bind the UK to EU laws and standards. He said, we very much need a change in the EU approach for the next round beginning on June 1. In order to facilitate those discussions, we intend to make public all the UK draft legal tests during next week so that the EU's member states and interested observers can see our approach in detail. The UK will continue to work hard to find an agreement, for as long as there is a constructive process in being, and continues to believe that this is possible. According to the Daily Mail, a senior government source has said, breakdown is entirely possible. Mr Frost said that once the EU realises that the UK will not accept an agreement where the country is bound to its laws and standards, the conversation could progress. Downing Street fears the UK could end up with an Australian-style deal with the EU. This would mean tariffs on imported and exported goods according to the World Trade Organization. Last Friday EU's chief negotiator Michel Barnier said, The round that we have just had is disappointing, very disappointing. I hope the next round in June and the one after in July will be more positive. The end of June would be the legally binding deadline for any extension request to be made. Britain officially left the EU on January 31 but remains tied to it until the end of the year. The two sides need to come to an agreement on their relationship, including trade, fishing and security. Prime Minister Boris Johnson has made it clear he does not want to extend the deadline of leaving the EU.